What's up guys? I am John Schmidt here at Mocha Monkey with Jeff Lensmeyer. We're talking about the Art Wander, which is coming up end of September, last weekend of September. We are super pumped. You guys ready for it? I'm ready. You ready? Let's do it. Jeff, why don't you tell them, what is the Art Wander all about? All right, well, both John and I have been involved in the Art Wander for the last eight years. So this is our eighth annual Art Wander, and the Art Wander is a self-guided studio tour that takes you all throughout Carver County to see all of the artists and their creative abilities. And what's really unique about the Art Wander, it's not an art fair, um, it is a studio tour. So you get to see the artists in their studios, working, creating their pieces. Uh, you get to see the process and actually meet the artist. Where a lot of times, you know, you show up at an art store and you can buy the art, but you don't know the artist and the story behind it. And here's an opportunity to really start to build that relationship with an artist. Maybe even commission a work, who knows? Yeah. So Jeff and I are both potters, so my pottery is here. I demo outside at Mocha Monkey. Um, I'm throwing pots like all day for a couple days. Jeff, you have your wheel out there yep. too. We throw pots out um, of my place too. But there's tons of different artists. There's painters, drawers, mixed media, jewelers, mosaics. mosaics, like so many different types of art. You can, pretty much anyone can find something they love um, or something that you're interested in. I always find it fun, there's just, groups of kids that like come around and like the kids just love watching the wheel throwing. Well it's a great opportunity for kids to see that there are people <laughs> who are alive that are creating art. Yeah, yeah. Um, whereas a lot of times in school they learn a lot about art history so artists who have since been but um, we've got artists working in our community and adding to the cultural fabric of, of our communities here in Carver County and Carver County is full of artists. Uh, it's amazing. Um, and this is a great chance to, to get into their studios and meet. This map stretches all the way from Chaska. Chaska Chanhassen is the furthest east, east that we, go. That we yep. go. And then all the way out to Mayer. Yes. Right? So we're going to head out to the farthest west studio right now. Just Carl's are. place. Let's go see Carl. All right, let's go see it. Shh. Um, with Carl Melkar. Carl's one of our studios, Studio A on the Art Wander Tour. And Carl, what kind of art do you create? I'm basically working a lot with wildlife artwork, animals, birds, butterflies, anything that crawls outside. I love it. Awesome. So let's take a look at Carl's studio. This was used, my dad got it back in the 50s. 57, he used it for a tool shop. Um, it was basically a blacksmith shop, a cabin, people could stay upstairs, but it's, it's original 1896, and I didn't find that out until about 10 years ago. It's carved upstairs in the rafters, but she's mint. And we're just showing the community that what kind of artwork is out here in Carver County. Tell me about the Art Wander. So the Art Wander, it's the eighth year. Started basically about 10 years ago planning it. It was uh, bringing ideas from, hey, bringing some ideas from the Art Meander, which is out west in Minnesota, on the Minnesota River. Yeah. So the friends of ours out there that were doing that, and we thought, why don't we just bring something back here where there's a lot of artists in Western Carver County. Yeah. Lots of artists. So what makes the Art Wander special or different? The trees, the fall. You know, and that's why it's called the edge of the big woods. Yeah. We're on the edge of the big woods yeah. when it comes to the fauna and the trees and things. And at that time of year, everything is like brilliant. You've got your trees turning everything. You know, your maples are out here and your oaks are starting to do that too. So we wanted to make it special so people could wander from studio to studio amongst the trees. Whereas out west at the meander, they wander the river. Mm -hmm. And this is the special part around here. And it brings out a special kind of artist too. So they're all pumped up in these little hollers and you go to these nice little studios and visit. So it's artist driven. Yeah, artist driven. I'm not an artist. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I'll buy art. Well, you're a musician, that's an artist. I'm a musician, but I'll buy the art. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's the special part. Yeah. You can actually see it being made, even though you don't buy, you still get pumped up and your, your inner energy about being around people like that just kind of makes you feel good. Yeah, you know? yeah. And that's, 
you know, I might buy one or two things a year, but just going to all the different places make you just kind of like feel good. Yeah, yeah. Especially that time of year, it's the fall. Uh, it's, you know, it's not your commercial art, it's your handmade stuff. Yeah, yeah. And it's right here in your it's community. It's right here in Western Carver County. Yeah. Right? And most people don't know about it. Yeah. You know about those little studios. But this is nice. You don't have to go to a cubicle in a park. Everybody, you go to the studio itself or stuff. Yeah, yeah. You know, and this one is real special. Because of the artists, but also because of the region that you're in. Yeah. So. Something special, you know, to... to Show people, you know what I mean? Yeah. There's special things like some people have special foods there. You know, they something welcomes them when they come in there. It's yeah. gonna be different. That's what's kind of cool. They're all individual. I mean, variety too. Like. Yeah. The variety. It's everywhere. You've got everything from woodworking to metalwork to watercolors to photography. You know, lots of jewelry. A lot of places to spend your money. <laughs> Jeff, what do you think about our water? <laughs> How many do we have on the tour this year? We have 40? We have 40 artists. 40 artists. And 17, studios? 17 studio locations. Okay. And you'll see these posters around town reminding you of when the dates are. And your studio's on the tour as well. It is. Downtown Carver. Historic downtown downtown Carver. Carver. Ripple Art Studio, which, right on Broadway. Which letter? We are letter M. M for Mary. So M and N, we have a new... Uh, uh, couple artists at Studio N, Strange Birds. Yep. You'll see some contemporary work there. And, and mine, then you just walk have, down the block. Yep, come to me and we'll see mosaic and jewelry and painting. Uh, we've got some mixed media artists on display as well. Well, we got something new this year too, John. Yeah, let's hear about it. Well, we've got um, Southwest Transit has been very gracious, so thank you, Southwest Transit. Um, they've donated two trolleys for both Saturday and Sunday of the Art Wander. So that would be the 28th and 29th of September. And they will be touring um, the outlying studios uh, of Waconia. And then we have one that will be on the eastern side of Carver County, um, going through Chaska, Chanhassen, and Carver. So these brochures you can find, where can people find these brochures? Here at Monk Monkey, we have a ton of them. <laughs> uh, they can be found throughout Carver County at your local businesses. Uh, we're in the process, the artists are out running around getting them out there. So there's yep. a map inside. The artists have more information in there about them. It's an amazing thing. You can also find out all the information you need to know at artwander.com. Yep, and we'll give updated bus schedules and times, so those will be uploaded to the website soon. So check it out. You can also see a slide video of all the different artists in the Art Wander and several more of their pieces uh, versus what's in the brochure, but the brochure is kind of a teaser and gets you excited about what uh, you might be able to see or where you would like to go think about going uh, during the Art Wander. Awesome. Well, it's one of my favorite events all year. Uh, you really don't find that many events like this around. No. And you'd be amazed at the amazing talent of the artists in this community. It's, it's really unbelievable. So wherever you're from, think about making a trip out to uh, Carver County for this year's Art Wander. All right, folks, when you're out traveling around for the Art Wander, I want you to look for these signs. And this will point you to the, all the studios throughout Carver County. We'd love to see you. September 27, 28, 29, uh, Friday 1 to 7, Saturday 9 to 6, and Sunday 11 to 4. Check us out. We're on Facebook, Instagram, all the socials. And uh, yeah, artwander.com for more. All right. Thanks, we'll John. See you guys there. <laughs>